Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Warmer 40k Sanctus Reach in the next turn and yes we are losing pieces on through the artillery. It's always you know it's always the artillery is against especially against infantry absolutely deadly that you just have you know to be aware about but that was the reasoning I um prefer at least with the Imperial Army um, with the Space Marines that was never the real problem that's why I actually prefer to you know take um, tank heavy armor and prefer that more than um, infantry armor. I was a little bit scared about our Lehman Russ there but Actually, in the end, I didn't need to be so scared. Three knights, I mean, that means so much firepower. That is just insane. So, um, I'm not scared. I th I feel good. Um, I know they were going on the middle here. They were still going to be enemies. But right now, I feel it's actually quite well. And I think it's a little bit heavy how many... Um, Mega knobs the enemy currently has there is quite insane because as you can see they hold up so much this is a little bit crazy but they can be killed as well so there's another one okay that is insane as well as you can see how many of these guys are here one two three four you kill one upstairs not upstairs up up there we there are quite a lot of big units there which we have to deal with in our turn so he's hitting his own guy that is absolutely amazing he did more damage to himself than to us that is what I like and I definitely need to take care of the flash kits in the next round so at least we did 150 damage please survive please survive this one is utterly important against our against the flesh kits here and we are a little bit in trouble right now we are definitely in trouble right now I can only hope that we do enough up here So, more artillery, which we have to deal with in the next, in our next turn. And I hope I can that, uh, can we can do that. Whew! I was, in the beginning of this episode, I said it looks good for us. Now it looks a little bit more dire, I have to say. So, let's see how we are going to deal with them enemies. So, just a hundred fifty... Are you kidding me? You've got to be joking me. That is, again, the things in the game I do not like. They, The enemy always has its nice reaction fire. And you can't really do anything. So, at least they're gone us now. Then now, I'm going to focus on the battle wagon with super cannon. Because that one is absolutely insane so maybe I can shoot oh I need to take care of the artillery as well 15 damage I hope for a little bit more 202 there that is nice that is nice that is nice oh, you can shoot that one if I hit that would be absolutely amazing did not really good and now that one. So the first mech gun is down. That of course is of course absolutely amazing. And now of course I want to deal with that one. Because the you know the shield disabling um, mechanic of this guy is absolutely insane for us. So then this cannon fires into those guys. I have to deal with them as well. Or we have to deal with them as well. And now let us then 
move that one here, take another. Well, you know, we do it that way. Should have just shot with that <laughs> and not the heavy water. Um, what else do we have down here? I that night moves completely on. That would have been absolutely amazing against those guys, but now I'll just do something like that. Well, not the best kinds of damage there, but better than nothing. Can't shoot there, but I turn here, and with these guys I turn like so. And they turn here as well, and you turn like so. Oh, no. I actually wanted to turn the knight, because there I have the hope of shooting them when they get at us. That is just my little hope here. Whether that is going to work out or not, we will find out soon enough. So, another thing to fire at these guys. So, at least one squad is down. That, of course, is quite cool. Moving this guy here to deal with them enemies. The rest, for now, is moving up. Can't shoot. And... Well, I think I move one sentinel around here, or even two. Is on the hunt. Depending... No, okay, can't kill him. So I'll move two, then I can capture that point as well. I think that would give us a little advantage. And the synergy here is that I, in the next round I can kill the mech gun. So that as a little plan from my side. And I think I'm gonna move the other artillery around here. I assume I can't fire here. No, I can't. But... Vanquish, of course, moves completely up. Can he? Yes, he can. Then do it. Come on. Two shots in Wayne there. Can I? Okay, can fire everything, so... That's bad, man. That is really bad shooting. So, can you hit anything here? No. So, I bring myself in a position to fire. Well, if anyhow, before we do that, I... I think it wouldn't be too bad to f uh, finalize our movement on this side. Let us do that quickly. So we have everything done in order actually. So I think I've moved everything here. And then to the crazy part right here. So good thing is I can deal with those guys in close combat. That is oh so amazing because they are pretty damn annoying. And I nearly took them down completely. So these guys kill them. I give them the crack grenade upgrade and shoot the big guy there. Concentrating our fire on him. Alright, um, you then, please do your best. Oh, come on. And do it. Down to 130, that is not too, too bad. And this guy, uh, this guy moves himself in a better position. Probably then don't be shot at. Like these guys, but right now I don't really care, so I can do something like that and give him a little bit of damage. As you can see, he still is at 93 HP. That is not really cool. 65. That was nothing. 
still at 65 damage. Um, I'll then move the Lehman Russ here. Can't shoot him nice. So the only shots I can take then are at this guy. So do it. Not the best of damage, but I didn't have too, too much choice there on where to shoot. So I wanna take some pot shots at the flesh kits here. So I think I can take them out if both of my shots hit, but again, you know, you crit your, you crit your own guys there, that is the usual thing in this game, which I really, I tell you, not like the that the what I want to say that the dices most time are actually rolling against you that is really annoying so take it down so one less of these guys that is so amazing now then we have to finish off the battle wagon there that should you know work out the next turn so again if you think about we have um, on this flank three of these guys two of these guys one of these guys there are four of the knights this is quite insane how many units the orc um, forces how many big units the orc forces actually have down here but anyhow that is just Sanctus reach at its best, but I don't want to complain here. I don't want to complain too too much. That's what I wanted to say All right, these guys Can't do much can they? Um, I don't know oh, because they are blocked by them aren't they? Anyhow that then brings us to the end of this episode guy oh, now let us take a look at the orc turn and then we are finalizing this episode. The good part, I think, is that in the next turn, the mech gun is gone. That is oh so amazing for us. Because, because this thing is so painful and I think I know the action what the enemy is doing there. Is through the new thing he um, got the reaction fire there. So 190 damage we did nearly 200 damage to this guy in one round that is quite amazing so this guy should be in trouble in the next round that I did not expect to happen so soonish then we still have a problem with the battle wagon but I think we can take care of it pretty easy in our turn So still plenty of big guys coming up, but I think we are on a good way to win the, the last mission here. I know, I always say it looks good and then in the end um, there are so many orc forces coming up, but with the force I think we still have at our hand, it really looks good and that is the thing I wanted to see. I, you know, I, I was, when, when I started this mission, I was really terrified, you, you mean, uh, you know what I mean, I mean, on this big, huge map, I know we had a couple of knights and everything, but it's not bad, but there were so many orc forces, I was really afraid. Okay, that did not much, that is good, and the next turn I can shoot him in his back that is what I want so the good that we have two knights down here which will clean things up I hope and please survive please survive please survive ah oh, good lord so he can use the scatling gun against the flash kits but I I, I, I assume here are going to be plenty of orc units <laughs> and should be our turn any second 
And that, guys, brings us actually to the end of this episode. In our next turn, we will stride on and um, fix the problem down here, I hope. Let's see. Oh, we did really good damage here. And for now, guys, we are at the end of this episode. And as usual, I really thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, guys, you beautiful people, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And I will see you in the next episode. Until then, have a nice day. Stay frosty. Bye.